In Uganda, when one learns something of importance, tradition demands that one beats the drum loudly so that others are alerted. For far too long, the land has been deteriorating from lack of knowledge and poor agricultural practices. This has led to drought, poverty, desertification, and a host of other problems. You'll find most children, especially girls, drop out of school during such a period due to water scarcity. They trek a lot of distance, they miss classes looking for water. Instead of losing these young and capable minds, the Eco Schools Project of Conservation Efforts for Community Development in Uganda is enlisting the nation's most progressive teachers and their students to lead a campaign to restore the land to ecological health. The Eco Schools program in Uganda is building community resilience to desertification and climate change using schools and children as agents of change. When this uh, hill is covered with forest, that means we will get water both for agriculture and for domestic use. The children bring the knowledge, the new knowledge to the parents and demonstrate its effectiveness and the parents will adopt it. And as every parent knows, there is nothing more compelling than one's own children. So this is the biodegradables. After rotting, we put them in the banana plantation and we make manure. We should use sustainably utilize what we have without uh, compromising the lives of the future. And here we are, the reason why we want to focus on the young ones, have that knowledge at a tender age, believe in it, and pass it on to the generation to come. The trees help in acting as windbreakers, source of manure to the soil, used as source of timber to the community. They also help in eradicating the problem of greenhouse effect in the environment. It stops even the problem of desertification in the area. They also stop the problem of soil erosion. They provide shade. They also generate income to those who work in them. This project is arming the leaders of tomorrow with the knowledge they need to build a sustainable future.